Hi. I was called back for a role I auditioned for last week. You're Isabel. Take a seat, hon. Kevin should have sent you the script. Uh, <clears throat> I got it last night. Excellent. Hey, glad to see you back. Hey, I know. I was super happy when I got the call back. You won't kill it again. Hmm. Well, I didn't expect to see you back so soon. I thought you might be busy. Enjoying your new fame. Ha! My new fame? Yeah, right. Oh? Okay. So you know when I left here last time, I got a call saying I got the part, right? Okay. But I don't know what happened between the minute I left here, took the train, stopped at Starbucks for a quick fixer-upper mocha frappuccino grande with low-fat milk and whipped cream on top. Because when I got to the audition room, I wasn't expecting this to happen. Huh. So, are you going to say what happened? Right. So, I'm looking over my script, and my nightmare walks in. Sophie? Perfect. Go ahead and take a seat and we'll get started in about five. script and um, and I see that there's only one female character in, in the scene I'm just wondering if I have the right copy since there's there's two of us sitting here no that's the right script oh okay it's, it's just that when I got the call the message said um, that I got the part Yeah, right. Yes, these things happen. I was torn between you both. So I called you for a second audition before I locked in on my decision. What? Feeling insecure? You should. What's your problem? I'm good. Are you good? Oh, I'm perfect. We both know who's gonna get the role here. Just hope you're not a sore loser. <laughs> okay, ladies, I'm loving the rivalry, but let's save some for the audition. Hmm? Kevin, can you get the gags ready? So this time, we're going to be doing things a little bit different. You both have the same script, but you're going to be delivering the lines differently. Okay? Isabel, we're going to start with you first. Kevin is going to do the lines with you, and I want you to be scared. 
frightened, frustrated, if you will. This should be good. And then Sophie, you're gonna do the lines with attitude, fearless. Well, that's easy. She doesn't have to act. <laughs> All right, let's get started. Kevin, could you tie the cloth for her, please? Oh, we're, we're starting with the cloth? Yes. Okay, <clears throat> quiet on set. Action. Get over there. I said move. Okay. Okay. Oh, and how do you ask? On the ground. Keep still. Mm, cut. I don't think the cloth is working. Uh, Kevin, could you could you get the ball? Um, the ball. What's that? I don't think I'm comfortable with the ball thing. Cloth ball, they're all the same. You'll be fine. I had my share of gags, trust me. I was kidnapped by a psycho with an asthma inhaler. I had to knock him out with a can of paint. That's all I got for you. Well, that's not something you hear every day. Let's do the lines again. Action! Oh my goodness. You were just stuck for anything, aren't you? I didn't really have a choice. I mean, as an actor, I have to be flexible, right? It's showbiz. I guess you're a celebrity now, so... Might as well go balls deep. Hmm? That's not funny. I'm a professional. I don't drug during therapy. Come on. Please, continue. 
So I got this ball in my mouth, right? And I'm trying to set my mouth right so that I can say the lines. And drool is falling down my shirt. It was so grotesque. A little vomit came up and I swallowed it. Get over there. I said move. Okay. On the ground. Sophia, Kevin, could you remove her mouth, please? Watch and learn, Blondie. I'll show you how it's done. Oh my god. 